that worked. Oh noes. Oh noes, oh noes. Okay. Hopefully everything sounds good. I just, yeah, I just noticed my mic wasn't plugged in. The light wasn't on. That's not good. So hopefully Shane's in here soon to let me know how I sound. Hopefully someone's on Twitch. Uh, let me log on to Twitch, by the way. So first of all, welcome everybody. This is a prize stream. We're trying to get this done before the end of the year. And it's going to be tough to get this done if um, we just do it on Sunday. It would have to be an extra long episode on Sunday. And I don't think Shane wants that. I don't really want that. I do not. <sighs> there he is. Do I sound good? My mic wasn't plugged in. I just want to know if I sound good or I sound like shit. I mean, you, you sound fine to me. I, I don't have the stream up yet, so I guess that could be different. Little, little concerned. At least I'm not as concerned as I was earlier when my computer almost took an absolute shit on me. That was yeah. fun. That was, oh, God. Oh, my God. That was, any case, look. Once again, we're pushing for charity. This is for charity. This is this is for kids, and this is video games. Kids and video games. There's nothing wrong with kids and video games, okay? Like, you may not like kids, but you like video games. You like those kids to grow up and playing video games so they stop being annoying kids at least. I think that goes down that process of thought. So, if you that want... That sounds right. I don't know. If you don't like kids, but you want them to grow up to be smelly nerds like yourself, and I'm not saying you're a smelly nerd, but if you don't like kids, you're probably a smelly nerd... Or you know smelly nerds. And maybe you don't want them to be smelly nerds. You gotta donate to the link. Other side. There. You gotta donate to that link over there. Go to that link. You'll figure out who to donate to. That's Child's Play. Once again, this year has been an absolute bitch. If you're living in the United States, and uh, most of our audience is, we, we, I think we have a couple Canadians. But if you're... Uh, watching this United States, and if you're in another country, I don't mean to offend you, but listen, I'm just saying this for the sake of brevity, and I'm making it much longer by doing that. But, like, the stimulus check that was passed by Congress, and who knows if it's going to go through, who the fuck knows what's going to happen? Uh, it, it doesn't really take care of a lot of us, and a lot of people uh, lost their jobs this year, the economy's really tough, restaurants aren't getting a lot of money, and this is a unique year. If you have the money to donate, again, I'm not. You may be watching this for entertainment. You might have not have the money to donate, but if you do, please head over to the site that's listed over there, and um, see if you can donate the child's play if you have the money to. We've donated forty dollars already. We plan on donating another amount once the stream is over and we calculate what Lyle laid out to us for the charity, and uh, we are looking forward to it just because any little bit, any little bit helps. You know, I've heard a, a good saying this year is anything worth doing is worth doing poorly. It sounds terrible, but that's because if you're going to do something, um, just going out and doing it poorly is better than not doing it at all. But I'm not saying if you don't have the money to donate, don't donate. Of course not. We, I wouldn't say that. But... Unless you're a bridge architect, in which case, don't, don't do it poorly. There's exceptions, okay? <laughs> all right. But yes, please, please donate to the, to the chillins. Yes. So um, without further ado, I'm going to get this thing started. And I'm excited because it looks like that it saved my controller settings for once. Hey. Uh, so I am going to play this game. By the way, I'm going to send this link over to Shane um, so he can be my, my friendy friend, my Sherpa Sherpa. Mm. And... Uh, he can look up the maps too. The maps I'm going to need more help with, so he can try and get through this so I don't go into any unnecessary rooms and take any unnecessary damage. That is what's going to be key. All right. There you go, Shane. Shane has the link. <sighs> All right, let's see. Perfect. I'm going to get this thing started. Okay, no one cares about your intro square. Alright. Gonna load the game. Alright, three crystals. And I'm in Melmond, because everyone likes being in Melmond. Of course. 
It's where the dead people hang out. It's where all the glitter vampires like, yes. to, like to chill. So I know I gotta go to a city. Where's Gaia? So, yeah, so you gave we gave the Rosetta Stone to the Doctor and Melman. Now you gotta go to Lufinia and collect the chime. Okay. So I think it's... I think I have to go here. Okay. You were playing with two sticks yesterday, weren't you? I mean, two uh, days ago. No, no, actually, I was just playing with the D-pad. How did you get to, uh, how'd you scroll on the other side? How'd you, uh, select the, uh, cities? Uh, I don't know. It just kind of defaulted to doing that. <laughs> I can't land there. I think that's where I need to go. Actually, where do I get level 5 spells? Because the red mage... can learn life. Finally. Yeah. I just can't remember where that is. So this is in Corneria. That's in Provoca. Don't know where three is. There's five. And you get that. Uh, is that Crescent? I don't know. I'm trying to... Figure that out now. Life, 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 life. <laughs> Melmond. That's ironic. <laughs> yep. Is there anything here that the red moon? Oh, they can learn exit. Too bad I have everything filled out. Well, because I have. I want to unlearn it! Denied. I don't need it that bad. It's fine. I'm leaving. Alright, I'm gonna head back to Melman then. Level 8 spells will be coming up soon, too. I don't know exactly. I can't remember where to get them, but they'll be coming up. I don't know if I can get them in Gaia or not. Or any of the northern cities. Mm, let's see. Level 8. There's, there's like one in each city. It's weird. Uh, you can get stop in Gaia. I don't know if I want that. Uh, nuke in Lafine? Lafine? That's, yeah, that's Flare. Teleport! So that, that uh, storage, the, uh, whatever the one that is apparently just four X's. That's death. Okay. <laughs> it's also in Gaia. And Zap is also in Gaia. Those are the Black Mage spells? So I should head to Gaia first. Let's go to Gaia. Yeah, those are all the Black Mage spells. The White Mage spells are Transfer, Fade, Life 2, and Can't use Wall. Them. Can't use them. Cool. Well. <laughs> that's that's the weakness of the Red Mage. Once you get the level 7 spells, it's over. Call it a day. Is this guy? Huh? Yes, this is guy. Alright. See how much those level 8 spells cost if we can get them. Uh, 60,000 a piece, according to this. Kapalizaga. For the red, for the red wizard. He's no longer a mage, he's a wizard. As long as he doesn't become a Grand Wizard, I'm cool. Yeah, well... I mean, then he'd just be a white mage, right? Oh, snap! <laughs> it's a little spicy. Let's 
Stop. Warp. Kill. Oh, we can't do those yet. They don't have high enough levels. Slink kills one foe, banishes this foe to another dimension, and stop times and paralyzes all foes. So maybe stop might be worth it. We'll find out. I'm going to have to move Penny at first. I have to gain levels anyway if, I, if they want to be worth a fuck. I think they have Flair in Lupinia. That's what I want. I want Flair. To put on my jacket. Hey, you, gotta, you gotta put them on your suspenders, man. Damn right. Uh, but, yeah, like, whatever the... the uh... I'm gonna have to walk a long way, aren't I? Yes, I am. Is that the equivalent of whatever they call them, nuke? Is that what yes, that is? Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Why the hell did they change the names? Uh, because they can only have four letters. Huh. In the Nintendo, and Nintendo wasn't going to do death. I guess that's true. I can cast magic on the way down there. You can't use magic. You can. This is going to take a minute. As I work my way south. Hey, what's going Victory. on, Llama? Hey, Llama. Nice to see you. Speaking of nuke, die, monster. You don't belong in this world. Ah! We had someone in our Discord earlier exclaim uh, sacrilege by saying he did not like Symphony of the Night after going back to it recently. He said it was really bad. I mean, like, real talk for a second, though, I I don't 100% disagree with him. Like, What? Okay, listen. I like the first half of Symphony of the Night. I actually really didn't like the, like the 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 reverse castle much at all. I'm I'm gonna be honest. Okay. Like it, I think back at back at that time, it was one thing where you're just like, oh shit, there's like a whole other half of this game. That's amazing. But like when I played it, it was more like, oh, I thought I was done with this, and now there's all this other bullshit I have to do. <laughs> Yeah, that's 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 fair. That's fair. it's not that it, it's not a bad game. I the game is still great. I mean, yeah. it controls extremely well. It's a lot of fun to play. Like it feels good. The, like there's there's nothing wrong with it. I just I I almost felt like maybe the the the, the reverse castle or whatever was almost kind of unnecessary. Let's be fair. I think I felt that way in ninety. 97 as well, 98, somewhere around there. It was no. never really that necessary in terms of a... I mean, it was cool at first until you realized it feels like an afterthought. <laughs> yeah. Like, there are some areas you could tell they put some thought into it, and then there are some other areas they're like, they just don't care, do they? Like, they just, like, like this is cool, let's just do it. Yeah. There you go, Llama. That's a that's a good way to put it. <laughs> I agree. You need to teach me how to put the chat up in the in the stream. I, I can't I can't figure it out. Well, you also decided to use a, a different streaming software than I did, just to be difficult. So you know, I don't I don't know what to tell you. Speaking of, uh, like, post-game things that are probably really not necessary, but we ended up doing them anyway, mm. I'm uh, currently 20 levels into uh, the Chrysler building. Nice! In Parasite Eve. Only 79 so. more to go! Uh, that's only 50 more to go. Thank you. That was 99. That was 99. <laughs> no, it's only 70 levels. Oh, okay. Only. 
I can't wait until this episode comes out. I think I had a lot of fun recording this most recent episode. I may, yeah. have, said, I may have said some completely obscene things, but it felt right at the time, so please don't cancel me Twitter. <laughs> well, you know, also that's the magic of editing. <laughs> But it makes sense. Like, you can't get rid of all that. Some of it's good. I hope. <laughs> Where am I supposed to buy these stupid you spells? I'm supposed I to get didn't. a spell here, right? Where am I supposed to get Flare? Flare's here, right? I don't know. Where the fuck are you at? I'm in Lufania. Uh, n n no. Unless they renamed it. Like uh, everything else. Um, Hold on. Where the hell is the... Oh, shit. I talked to the right person the first time. Oh, well, okay. I obtained the chime. I don't know what I'm supposed to do now, but I got a chime. Okay, but I can't, no one can use level 8 magic yet, so it's not like I care. Oh, yeah, no, it, it is there. Really? Although, apparently the magic shops are secret? What? Where the, f how the fuck do you get into them? Hold on. Yes, I'm in Lufia. I don't... I, I think I'm in the prequel or the sequel. I'm not sure yet. So, according to the map for Lufinia, the magic shops are way the fuck off outside the city walls, unlike the northeast corner of the map. So, I guess there's a way to, like, exit up there and then just go to the right. Do they have, like, an inn or an item shop? Hmm... Not that I can see. It's kind of shitty. Yeah. Oh, my airship was built by Sid. Shocker. Wow, really? Crazy. I think that was just retconned in, by the way. I'm just going to put that out there. I don't remember <laughs> that in the original game. But yeah, if you follow, I think, the light green grass when you exit the top right corner, <sighs> um, <clears throat> it should... Hey, there, there they are. Flare. Can't, can't yeah, get there that. You go. Full life. Can't get that either. Great. Great, great, great. Okay, so how do I use the chime? Fantastic. Uh, doo, doo, doo. Man, that, oh, okay, we get the detailed walkthrough. I was like, this ain't telling me shit. All right, uh, so after you do that, return to your airship. Um, make sure you stock up on healing and items and shit if you need them, because this isn't the point of no return, but you're going to be away from shops for a while. And we do not have a powerful party. Yeah. Um, so once you're prepared, though, head just south of uh, where you landed to reach Lufinia. I don't know what that, that means exactly, but you'll see a single patch of grass next to a vast desert. Land the airship there and then start hiking to the west and you'll see the Mirage Tower. Okay. So. I agree. Llama, that is a pretty cool retcon. It keeps it in line with the other Final Fantasy. Now every Final Fantasy has a sit. Hey, Gorp got a lot of hit points. Good for you, Gorp. Congratulations. Yay. This encounter race is getting very annoying. Ba -dump, ba -dump. Sand hit. Oh, wow. Another one. Winter Wolves. I'm about to use the healing staff, because why not? And fuck these motherfuckers up. I like how I can use the uh, item, even if it's not equipped. I think in the original it had to be equipped in order to use it. So that little that little detail 
I adore. That is a that is a welcome change, yes. I think Shane's more excited that we can go back and play Turtles in Time once we're done with this. I, I am. <laughs> I feel like we're gonna have to. We'll need to plan to do something else though, because I mean, unless we really fuck it up, you know, we'll be done in like 25 minutes. <laughs> uh, we can roll right into Hyperstone Heist. Oh yeah, there you go. I've never even played that one, so yeah, that'll be interesting. We can make another event for charity too, like have a uh, like a Christmas Eve run for charity, 24-hour run for charity. I feel like I might not be able to sell that one to my significant other. I'm just going to put that out there. <laughs> not enough planning anyway. Yeah. Yes, time for Turtles. Yeah, we, we need it. Uh, and then we can do Turtles 2, the arcade game. Uh, Manhattan Project as well. We have we have some we have some options. Yeah, the arcade game is really good. I haven't played that one in forever. For the NES. We're playing for the NES. Hmm. Because I don't think we have a... You don't have a MAME emulator, do you? That can connect on... I mean, like... part of RetroArch? Yeah, a RetroArch can do pretty much anything, man. Okay. I know you can install it on an Xbox Series X, and you can play PlayStation 2 and 1 games on it. And 3 games on it. However, you can't do that on the PS5. What? Crazy. What? Almost like they did it on purpose. Oh, All right, I'm gonna go see if we need healing items first. Guy would probably be the best place to go. Let me check my items. Yeah, dude, can... hell yeah, man. That'd be a that'd be a kick-ass birthday. I mean, the only thing that would have made that better is if you got that along with like a pizza party. I think they came with free pizza, didn't they? By the game, the, there was like a the game. Pizza? What, like either the oh. first one or the second one did? Yeah. I guess that's not surprising. I thought you meant it just literally came with pizza. Like, you bought it at, like, a fucking Sears or something, and they're like, yeah. here's this slice of pizza. Yeah, to Toys R Us had pizza in the back, and it just <laughs> it was hot and fresh. It was like Little Caesars. They toss you a bag a of, like, totin frozen Totina's pizza rolls. <laughs> Here see, you go. You Fuck see, off, kid. You see kids coming in. Look, I already got the game, all right? I just need some of your fucking pizza. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Y'all yeah. yeah. got any more of them pizza rolls? I got any more of those Tinos? I need those Tinos. What about them bagel bites? Because <laughs> if you have pizza on a bagel, you can have pizza anytime. So it was on Super Bowl Sunday. Well, I hope you like football. I don't think you do, for based off our conversations. If you do, I'm sorry. I, I don't remember if you do or not. I might be Yeah, I feel like too. having your birthday on Super Bowl Sunday is like a 50-50 either a really awesome thing if you're yeah. super into football or sucks shit if you're not. Yeah, cuz no one gives a fuck about you on Super Bowl Sunday. I mean, unless, you know, I guess unless there are two just crap teams in the Super Bowl. Which is every year cuz it's not the Bears. <laughs> Duh, Bears. Finish that. Got ethers. 99 ethers. Let's get some more Phoenix Downs. I have a feeling we're going to need those. <sighs> oh, ye of little faith. Hey, I'd rather have no faith and be prepared than have a lot of faith and get fucked. <laughs> Football is fun with friends. By itself, you're 25% into it. I mean, that that's fair. Yeah. I mean, I don't even give a shit about football at all, but like... I've been known to play like a game of like flag football in back in the day, and I, I've enjoyed myself. Yeah. I will say it's happy talking to another February birthday person. However, see, my my usual group of friends are just a bunch of fucking hyper nerds because we 
instead of watching the Super Bowl, well, okay, not instead of, in conjunction with having the Super Bowl on in the background, we do something called Super Roll, where we just all get together and play like D&D and board games and shit all day long. So. Nerd! I, I, I think that is a superior celebration. Why don't why don't you do that with your friends on stream on Twitch on uh on Super Bowl Sunday this year? Let's we'll have Super Bowl Sunday. On Zoom. It's not like it's not like the pandemic's gonna be over by then. Yeah, I was gonna say I I, I don't think we're going to be doing it quite the same way this year. Alright, uh I'm in the Mirage Tower. You sure are. Uh, so this says it's not really that complicated, but it's tedious, so that's neat. Yay, tedium. Uh, you start in the south and must proceed counterclockwise to reach your destination. Right. It's really hard to get lost, but if you do, then you can use the maps here, which I have. Uh, most interesting thing to note is that you'll be fighting groups of vampires. Oh, everyone loves vampires. Uh, but they do give a large amount of experience, and at this point they shouldn't be all that difficult, so that's good. Treasure, treasure, treasure. Was there a treasure in that door that was right to the north of me as soon as I came in? Uh, hold on. Let me get the, uh, some maps open. So, you came in here. I hope we did you not are... drop. Did we drop? Hmm. No. Okay. Maybe it's my first stream. No, it's. I mean, I think it. Yeah, it still looks good. Uh, so I guess technically. Well, actually, what the fuck is this map? How do you? You have to go up. You can just go through the door. Wouldn't that just circumvent the? Oh, I see. Yeah, go. If you go through that door, you go into the center, and. Uh, Actually, there's like a shitload of chests in there. Okay. Let's gaze. But to, to go to the next level, you have to basically just go counterclockwise out the out the like the outer edge. Okay. Yeah, I just give a shit about the treasure. I mean, that's 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 fair. Yeah, actually, each one of these levels has quite a few treasure chests. Although it looks like. I don't know what those are. I can't tell if those are like trap tiles or. Hey, Llama, we should think about doing a. I know a lot of you guys do. A... D and D and secret levels. Maybe we could do like a little Super Bowl Saturday prior to Super Bowl Sunday. I think that could be fun. All right, so I'm in here. What do I do? The guy go north. I went through the so door. So when you go through the door, uh -huh. yeah, you go up north um, and then go west around clockwise and then up north. And you'll see an immediate, yeah, see that chest. Basically, just follow that. Just go in there. Like, no, just, just that first chest, just go south from that first chest and go, like, into the center. Okay. Ah, so you use the Zeus gauntlets. Who has them? Does anyone have them equipped? It? Equipped? I equipped it. thought the red mage did. Yeah, it's the right wizard. Or, it's a wizard. Or wizard. Whatever. Ooh, look at these Anne Rice looking motherfuckers. They do kind of look like Tom Cruise. They are dreamy. <laughs> I was thinking more Brad Pitt, but yeah, sure. Same thing. Antonio Banderas. There you go. Mm, yeah. Man, I gotta watch that again. It's been a yeah. long time. 
It was, it was a good movie, too. Got Aegis Shield. Hmm. Thing we can't use, probably. We'll find Some out. Money. Fuckload of money. Ooh, a Vorpal Sword. A very sharp crescent blade that doesn't do fuck all. I think I have this. Well, I think I have the Red Mage's ultimate weapon if I was reading a back earlier correctly. Until I get the uh, Murasame or Masamune. One of the two. So, like, I mean, what was the. What was the, uh, the Lewis Carroll thing about the Vorpals? There was a, there was a Lewis Carroll thing about a Vorpal sword? Sword. Yeah. You broke oh. up, so I didn't hear you. It may have made it to the stream. You, uh, oh, Jabberwocky, there you go. That's what it was. Oh, you can fight those things in Final Fantasy IX. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's that's where the whole four-pole blade thing came Kupo from. Kupo gained a level and was extremely disappointing. Fuck you, Kupo. Hooray! Also, for some reason, the stream shit on me, so... I, I had to reload shit it. on everybody. No, no, I think it's it's still going. It's just, oh. uh, I don't know. My internet had a hiccup or something. Uh, Llama said Jabberwocky, too. So. Yeah, well, I know. I saw him say okay. it. That's okay, okay, I, okay. I just want to give credit. Thank you. Thank you, Llama. Yeah, I remember the Snickersnack thing. I just couldn't remember what the creature was. I don't know why I thought Bandersnatch. Okay, so I got those treasures. Should I head back out the door and go counterclockwise around the world? Yes. All right. Nightmare and, and Black Knight. Yep. Yeah. And then you'll just hit the stairs to go up to the next floor, which is pretty much the same deal as far as needing to... Actually, wait a minute. Where the fuck is the stairs here? Come up there and go around. Oh, I see. Okay. So, on the second floor, once you get there, um, you'll come up on the same place as you were on the first floor. You basically have to start making your way counterclockwise around the edge. Eventually, you'll get to probably about 10 o'clock-ish on, so on the clock. And then, this floor. yeah, I know, but you're not going to do anything else other than just a bunch of random battles. There's no navigating. Okay. Um, you'll basically go around to about 10-ish o'clock or so, and then you'll have to go in one, like, layer, go up back clockwise a little bit, and then go inside, and then the stairs are, like, at 12 o'clock. But you'll probably see them when you walk by them. But the uh, the center of that room has all the chests in it. Okay. Anything good in there? Fuck if I know. I don't know. Great. I gotta bounce back to the detailed guide here. Let's see. Uh, do you do... Uh-huh. They don't actually tell you what's in these chests. Boobies. not useful at all. Lyle got a lot of hit points. Finally. And some magic points. Deathbringer. I got a weapon called a Deathbringer. Calls deaths when used and is more powerful. Fuck oh, yes. Shit. I got a better weapon on a random encounter than I do from these fucking chests. What the fuck are you all doing? These chests are like six hundred dollars stimulus checks. <laughs> I shouldn't scoff at six hundred dollars. I know for a lot of people that's a lot of money, but I'm stopping myself. <laughs> it is, but also it's definitely nowhere near enough. Nope. 
use your access right there. Okay, cool. The fuck? I have the Deathbringer. What am I doing? Ice is better. Gorp got no HP. Uh, more MP than normal, though. Yeah, well, that's the thing, man. It's like, you look at places like, uh, I think it was New Zealand, probably, where they were getting like $600 a week for somewhat extended period of time to like help cover expenses you know like the money that people like actually need to live giving us six hundred dollars in a one-time payment this far into the pandemic is just fucking ridiculous. asinine yeah uh, i mean it was executed wrong from the beginning i don't want to go into gory detail about why i think that is but it was executed wrong from the beginning mm -hmm. We didn't have our priorities right. Like, if we wanted people to stay home, we could have done it, and we didn't do the thing. The Red Wizard has, like, no magic capability. This has to be the worst, the most worthless class in all of Final Fantasy. Yeah, he's just, you know, marginally okay at most things. I'd rather... I almost, I almost would rather have a monk in three black mages. Almost. Because the the Red Wizard can now cast Light. And I don't know if we're going to need it, but it's better to need it and, and not have it than have it and not go the other way. <laughs> it's better to have it and not need it than need it and not have it. <laughs> very well put, yes. <laughs> Fool, fool, fool me once. Sh shame, shame on you. <laughs> fool me twice. You're not going to fail me again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I remember Simpler when... days. Yeah. Simpler days. I thought awesome. W was the, the worst thing that could have happened. I'm not. Nope. Don't get me down that road. <laughs> Hey! Zodiac gained a level, and eh, shit the bed. Good for him. Just great. Up the... I didn't have to do that. I just could have walked through the doors. Oh, great. Okay. Ah. <laughs> How about that? Just any any other topic? Any just other topic? Say? Please oh, give us yeah. a topic. Give us a topic, Llama. I love one. <laughs> Hellhound. I think Blissera is going to work good against a Hellhound. That's what they want you to believe. And it's probably Thunder. Nah, it's Blizzard. Good. Mmm. How do you like that, spicy doggos? Hot dogs. Ah! ah yeah. Holy fuck! The encounter rate is atrocious. Yeah, it is. Have you even made it like halfway around yet? No. 
Good lord. Now I know why they said this is tedious. Yeah. These vampires being assholes, too. Like, just die again already. Fuck. This healing stuff. How the characters from the Jungle Book went from no tech to personalized planes and tails. <laughs> That's a good fucking question. That 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 is an excellent question. Um, if I smoked weed, aliens. I would probably think that a lot more often. My answer is aliens. I agree. Was Baloo an immortal? Of course he is. Yes, I, I believe Baloo is actually uh, uh, an immortal jungle spirit. Yes. Who, uh, whose purpose on this earth is to teach us to uh, just live with the bare necessities and how to properly scratch your back on a tree. Yeah. Put that wood right up your back. That's right. Yeah, baby. Just bark for your pleasure. Okay, I'm at the, like 10 o'clock point that you're talking about. Oh, are you on the... Okay, you're on the second level. All right. Yeah, so you see... Okay, so yeah, you, you saw that the stairs were like right below you as you went by like 12, so... I didn't see that. I gotta... <clears throat> I gotta, uh... Wait till the stream catches up here so I can see where the hell you're at. Also trying to transfer the 8 billion equipment items I've gotten over to Wayne here so that I can tool the stats off eventually. Okay, yeah, at the 12 I see the stairs right below me. Yep. So, yeah, so if you go around to like that sort of 10 o'clock oh, area, the other, should be. The other 10 o'clock, okay. Y yes, the other 10 o'clock, yes. What the fuck did you think I was saying? Two o'clock? Isn't this like what you, like, gun time people use for directions? Koopo got a monster level! Way to go, Koopo! M -m 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 monster Way to show up after being almost absolutely useless for most of the game. You're 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 starting to show up. Me? What the fuck are you talking about? I've been fine. I was talking to Koopa. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, I mean that's that's the represent that's that's the in-game representative of me. Okay. I'm just saying there's only one person here who has their actual name in the game. And one made up person. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Where are the treasure chests on this level, by the way? So they're in the center room, but that's the thing, is like I wanted to see I need to see what it looks like on the actual game screen, because I have a feeling that they may be surrounded by a bunch of, like, bullshitty trap tiles or something. Hooray! Trap tiles. I love trap tiles. But I'm not sure, like, what these are supposed to represent on this map, so that's why I need to see what it looks like. Yes, Patron yes. Lyle. That's right. The patron, the, the first or second patron saint, I think is the, is the second patron saint? Second patron saint, I think. I think so. I th I don't remember now. I can't remember who was first. The the OG patron saints. One of the two OG patron saints. Yes. Yes, the Buffy fan. <laughs> uh... In normal context, that would be fine, because I, too, am a Buffy fan, but that game is a totally different story. 
Okay, so when you go in that door after you get through this random encounter with the three chimeras, um, they're in like a sort of circle formation in the center of that room, but there may be like a line of possible pitfalls or traps or something like around the edges of the room. So I guess my suggestion is stay to the center. At least till, till I can see what the fuck it looks like. Okay, so you go in. Oh, no, okay, they're just cool little glowy tiles. Alright, fuck it. No, you're fine. So yeah, you've got uh, six... Ten chests right in there in the center. Sweet. And I now have enough guns stocked up at the police station to start my own small militia. Nice! Thor's hammer! Which would be great if we had a white page. Hell page. yeah! Why did they just call it uh, Mjolnir? That's, that's my question. Lazy bastards. I think because prior to like the MCU, I don't think most people knew that that Thor's hammer was called Mjolnir. They have the Vorpal sword. I don't know, man. Maybe they're just like fucking Lewis Carroll nerds. I don't know. I mean, how does one explain the inner workings of a Japanese game developer's mind? I know I can't. I just forgot the light axe Castira and vampires are undead. That's true. Take that, sunshine. Cause that you don't you're not glittering now. Jabberwocky is greater than Thor, says Mass Lama. Hmm. I mean, the Jabberwocky is pretty badass. Especially in FF9. Sunblade. I feel like that would be good. Higher accuracy, lower the, attack. The, the, the vampire. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's good against Undead. I think I'll keep that on for now until we get to the boss. Dragon Mail. Say, can we, yeah, you know, say 10 bucks, we like nobody can fucking use it, right? I'm gonna put the uh, protect ring back on Gorp. What? You don't want to use his sweet lightning? You can use it from the item menu. Yeah, I guess that's true. And I can use Thor's hammer too. I thought the gauntlets had better, uh, like, stats than that. No. Uh, and uh, the. The, the protect train guard, guards from instant death. Oh, well. Okay, it's kind, then. Kind of important. I guess. That way you don't need to cast an old death. And that way you don't need old death, because... Our... Yeah. Which door is better to go through? Left or right? Hmm. Honestly, it doesn't really matter, but probably right, I guess. In through the outdoor. That's what nice. I like to do. Good. Our friend left on a journey to the west! <laughs> he took the warp cube and went to see our master! Okay, man. I think his voice modulator is broken. A little bit. All right, where do we go? Ah, uh, fine. You, you go around. Well, actually, this tower, this one's really small. Um, just literally fucking go around. Okay. And then there's a door at the bottom. Are 
Werewolves undead? No, they're not undead. They are not. No. no. So on this floor, um, I think once you go through that door, you're going to hit a teleporter that takes you to the Flying Fortress, the home of Tiamat. Um, and I guess you're, you're going to get like, you're going to trigger a fight with a blue dragon as you step on the tile that's right before the teleporter. So, right. so there you go. Yes, yes, Lama is the master. Not master. Master! He's channeling James Hetfield there. Who? So this is like, oh god, yeah, okay, there's like Fuck you, Medusa. five levels. I don't want to use a gold needle. Yeah, it'd be great if I had enough slots to learn exit. Let's just get the fuck out of this place, like, eventually. No, I'm going to fight Tina. Zodiac gained another level, and he gained another... Eight hit points. Because why wouldn't he gain more than eight hit points? Twice in a row, I'm watching you. It's a blue dragon. Are you vulnerable to anything? Maybe you're vulnerable to Thundaga. Daga! I don't know. I don't... I, I don't think the... Maybe he's not vulnerable to Thundaga. He just casts Thunder. Oh no. That may have been a mistake. Let's say, is this just gonna heal him or some shit? No. Uh -huh. Dusa, who's Dusa? The, the Medusas, I think. Oh, okay. It's okay. I whip her. I whip their head arounds all the time. Yes, he whips them back and forth. One might say. I whip the Medusa heads back and forth. Whip them heads back and forth. I whip them heads back and forth. It's quality content that people come to the stream for. Yeah. I'm not talking that dude. I'm just gonna make me scream again. All right. All right. So now I'm in the other tower. Where'd I go? Any treasure? Anything I need to do? All right, so there's like five levels of this. Uh, there's basically four different wings on this level in the four, like, you know, cardinal directions. So really, we should go to everywhere except north first. So okay. I don't know. Go, go west, south. I guess. Going south. Okay, fine. Well, that one has one chest. Counter rate. Excuse me. It's real good. All right. It's going to be an ether party here soon. I'm pretty sure that's illegal. Ether parties? <laughs> yes. Those, those parties are illegal in California right now, so it doesn't really matter what you're doing when you get them. I guess that's true. But we're not in California. We're in Florida. No one gives a fuck here. Okay. It is a lawless swamp. Razor. Alright. Cast Scourge when used. Shave that disgusting beard that you've got. No. Absolutely not. That is the least sexy Naga I've seen since Beetlejuice. I would tend to agree. You know, I don't know why I never put that, like, two and two together. That, that he actually was kind of a Naga. And, uh, huh. 
And you can have, and they have pterodactyl heads. Did you just purposefully enunciate the P in pterodactyl? No. <laughs> why would I, why would I? Is this, is this like how you like to say aesthetic? It's aesthetic. No, it's aesthetic. You aesthetic. don't enunciate the A and the E. Aesthetic. No. no. See, beholder. It's a beholder. That is a fucking beholder. Uh, not really. Beholder is more like a big thing with like cthulhu -y tentacles on it. Where do you think they got the eyes. idea of shape? I mean, I'm not saying that they were <clears throat> inspired by it or anything, but you know. Yes, I say pterodactyl, and I say aesthetic. Right, and that's fine. You can huh. be wrong if you want to. I'm just saying that go that's get, not how... How about, how, that's, about, how about you go get mad at people say who say it. pop? Go get mad at people who say pop, and say ether. Oh, it is ether. Say Aegis. It is ether. What are you talking about? Aegis. Like, people say Aegis. It's Aegis. It's Aegis. If yeah, say... that's true. Also, I mean, and to be fair, I, I do I do take issue with people that refer to it as pop. <laughs> Copyright is in the eye of the beholder. Well, they do have mind flares. So there's that. But then also, I feel like we're kind of in that weird sort of like small subset region where some people just refer to every soda as Coke, even if it's not a Coke, and that's fucking weird also. You do have a lot of that here, yes. Did Koopa gain all of them? Koopa gain got more hit points this time. Good for you, Koopa. You're gonna catch up to lame-ass fucking Zodiac in the $600 stimulus package level-ups. Like yeah, it helps, but I mean, it could be a fuck ton better, asshole. Like I'm, I'm gonna take it, but I'm gonna complain about it the entire time. Yeah. Funny thing is, like, I don't think, like, no, I'm not, no, 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 not going to start, not going to start. No, are you sure? No. I'm sure, I'm sure, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, I mean, you can, you know, if you want. I'm just saying, like, like that, that stimulus probably, I mean, I know it, it's, it's just going to give me free money, essentially, because of where I work, and I'm very generous about that. Uh, not generous about that, but very thankful for it. Um, I'm not going to put anything out. I don't know if you're going to be getting it or not. That's, that's, I'm not. Oh, I, I 100% will not be. So. <laughs> yeah. I, I already know that. I didn't get the first one. Yeah. All right. Hey, Llama, thanks for joining us, man. Appreciate it. All right. Thanks, Llama. I'll see you in the, uh, the Secret Levels Discord chat. You can always swing by our chat as well. Um, but yeah, I will see you around. Have a good night, man. I think I use fire against these assholes. Well, they certainly resist the shit out of physical attacks. Well, they're dead now. Great. Manticores. They scared the shit out of me when I was playing D&D. Uh, when you're like level eight. Oh, his staff casts Fyra. Yeah. Know. Poison butt darts. All trying to poison me. Well, it's a good thing you got that ribbon. That's true.
Lyle gained a level and did really well. Good, good job, Lyle. He got a lot of hit points. He's still weak as fuck, but he got a lot of hit points. Well, at least that's something. Confused. Okay, so we do need to catch people's uh, raw on these assholes. A shitty level. Maybe they're weakening us like. Got another Deathbringer. Now no one can use that one. An Earth Medusa. That's oddly be specific. So, you've done the south and the west, you haven't done the east, right? Yeah, no, I did. Oh, you did? Okay. Well, good. Then you should just be able to go north and then you'll go to level two, which is. <laughs> okay. Pretty bland? Yeah, it's, it's basically now it's the cardinal directions plus the middle one, so like northeast, southeast. That kind of stuff. So basically, once you come in, and I assume you're coming in in the north part of it, just kind of make your way around. The entrance to the next level is just directly south of you. So just go to every spot except the southern piece. I think okay. there's what is that saying? There's something in like the southwestern corner that looks weird. What is that? Uh... Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it is, but I guess we're gonna find out. Hooray, finding out. Only another level with only eight hit points gained. Come on, man. Okay. So keep that in mind. I'll be right back. I got I got to uh, check on the toilet. Okay. Yep. Right Make sure it's still there. Make sure it's still there for a little bit. Mm -hmm. So, while he's gone, if you happen to be watching this, either either live right now, which looks like it's probably not the case, or on YouTube after the fact, which is probably more likely, depending on when you're watching this, you might be getting some insider information as to what our next episode is. You may have heard me mention that I was playing a certain game uh, while while he was doing this. If you remember what that was, then you'll know 
you'll know what our next episode is about. It's a Christmas game. So, you know, thematic. You can also hear the clicky clicky of the buttons. Probably. This would be a fantastic time for people to come in though. Just, just nothing. There's nobody on the camera. It's very dark. You're not even sure what you're looking at. disembodied voice all right i'm back oh god all right do i need to heal anybody no so you said head south and don't head head everywhere but which way uh everywhere but south south is the exit to the next level okay and there's treasure in each one of these yep sweet It happens when I cast Confuse on everybody. Right a bit, right a bit. I think it's good that we did the stream because this is taking a while. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, it does work. Okay, start northeast. Sure, a lot of battles. At least I'm like, the class has been changed, so I don't mind. Because every level just, it doesn't hurt me. I'm, Well, I think that's the thing. That's why this takes longer than you'd think it would. It's just because there's so many random battles. Yeah. Another battle. Another battle. Secret tunnel. Diamond gloves. I think someone else can put that. Apparently not. Okay. This is diamond armlet. I need to find more diamond armlets. That's my need. Dead. Alright, head east. Chimera. I could call this a Chimera. You you could do that. It would not be the first time I've heard it. Chimera. Especially in your D&D groups, I would imagine. Yeah. Yeah. Joke. Some of my monk's defense went way up, by the way. That's weird. Yeah. Seems like a good problem to have. I'm healthy. Hitting hard. Hitting hard. Diamond shield. 
Can you equip anything other than a buckler? I doubt it. You got your ribbon, Kupo. Yay! Now I am the pretty mage. I can't imagine playing this dungeon with spell slots and not having a, a, a warrior slash knight. That would be infuriating. Kupo gained a level, no hit points while well, three. And 23 MP! That's alright, which means I get to do more of the pew pew. To be fair, I don't think there was an elixir in the original. Stone Golem. Okay. It's a really weird pose. He wants to show you his jack. <laughs> he kind of just, just looks like he's like waiting for a money shot or something. I'm not sure how I yeah. feel about that. It's Golem Hub. Rock hard stone. Yeah, rock hard boner right there. He's got right. a rock hard boner. Ooh, another fight. I'm so surprised. Real talk, though, like, the Red Wizard should have way more hit points than the Black Wizards. Lyle gained a level, got 25 hit points. Good for him. Another big level for Lyle. Good job, Why Lyle. Why am I making that up? Starting to. He has the most amount of uh, magic points now. A black robe. And a white robe. That's an interesting little rally. And the robes cost Blizzara, and they're worse than the ruby armlet. How is that possible? Yay. Why would I even want that? I'm hoping it has some hidden effects. Lyle's getting it. I mean, because what even is proper itemization, really? It was a different time. Oh my god. Well, you have to, I have to remember that you couldn't use the item unless it was equipped to you. That makes a difference. I guess, yeah, if you were gonna make the decision to sacrifice stats for being able to cast a spell without... Well, I guess that's the thing, right? Is like, if this was done when it was still using spell slots, having a freebie spell was actually probably a really big deal. Big, big deal. So, I guess that makes sense. I mean, it's still, it's still an awesome thing to have. It, it is, but it's less of a value proposition now when you're just like, well, okay, I'd I probably have hip yeah. rather have the fucking stats or whatever. Yeah. Like, magic points, once you have magic points, the, the use of an item doesn't completely go out the window, but it, it doesn't, it's really nullified. Yeah. Oh, I almost forgot. I gotta get my, my free game on the the, the Epic store today before the day's over. I do not support Epic. I mean, that's fine. Technically, you're not really supporting it by just taking free stuff from them. But... Still won't do it. I mean, you know, I can, So that way I can say I don't support them and feel good about myself. It's like there, saying... There you go. It's like saying, I won't see that movie. We should boycott that movie when you never had any intention of ever seeing that movie anyway. <laughs> oh, apparently I already own the game they're giving away. Cool. Sweet. All right. Gorp, monster level, sort of. Doesn't get the MP, but got a lot of at HP, which is important. That is important. He, I motivated him. I motivated him to get that, that... 
I got adamantite, whatever that is going to fucking do for me. Apparently, that is some sort of material that you can make a really fucking sweet piece of equipment that we can later. Use. Yeah. Yeah. So that's fun. I think the best part about this dungeon is just that you just keep gaining levels. Like, great, I'm gonna be like a monster by the time I fight Tiamat. It's his fault he made his dungeon so fucking long. Idiot. What am I doing? More Gil! I have the feeling I'm at the, the point where Gil is almost useless, as long as I can bu buy my... ...whites, uh, my, my spells. Oh, and considering we're kind of hitting the top end of spells at this point, yeah. yeah. Probably won't need it much longer. And I can't equip all the nice things I'm fighting in these dungeons, so... Come on, die, die, die. Hey, there's a hit point boost. Holy shit, took Ooh. you long enough. Die, air elemental. No one loves you. Oh, you're more evasive now, and you're still dead. Ha ha ha! That's useful. Mithril Helm. Nope. So if he can equip it, no one can. Okay. Now we can move on. Yes. Oh my god, what even the fuck is this? Um, okay. Where do you come in here? It's probably, oh, it's one of, okay, one of those two support points. see where you okay so you ended up there well I, I mean you could i guess talk to the robot i don't know see what he has to say but um from, from where you came window you can look out <laughs> on the entire world great so if i talk um, about else, you're so okay from where you're at there uh Basically, north, west, and east all have rooms with treasure chests, and it seems like the southern area is just... looks like empty rooms. Okay, so I don't want to go there. Uh, I would probably just do, like, east, north, and then west, because west is going to have the uh, exit to the next level. Okay. Fair enough. Focus. Okay. The design of some of these levels is really fucking weird. It's to confuse you. Fight the Reynolds.
Oh, it tells you where the Chaos Shrine is. Where's the Chaos Shrine? Oh, that's where Garland was. What is going on? So, east. He said east, north, and west, right? In that order? Mm hmm. Okay. Protect Cloak? No. 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 No! Clothes. That's useful. Gold Needle. That is useful. More rock-hard cock in my face. Hell yeah. Yeah. Ah, oh, my fucking back. The shitty thing about running all the time is that your back starts to hurt like a bitch. That getting older. I can relate to one of those two things. Yeah. The running all the time, I imagine? Yep, that's the one. That's the one. Kupo. Shit level. Alright, so north. Nothing there. Oh, critical hit! 44 damage! Good job, man! It's like hitting the fall off the team. Him, that's not bad. Protect ring. Everyone has a protect ring already, though, so. Fire hydrants! Uh... So I use Blizzaga. They're going down pretty easy. Like a whore with a $600 stimulus check. Wow, that was one step. at full health. I can play this game. Lyle gained a level. Not a very good level. But he is still in the lead for magic points, not so much hit points. Another step. Holy crap. I'm fighting an Indian god. Great. <laughs> Doesn't look like I expected it. Nah. Putting me in compromising positions. Oh, Neil? I can't. 
kill. Sasuke's Blade. Okay, none of us can equip Sasuke's Blade. That must be for the ninja, which would make sense. Monk damage output is awesome. Gained a level? It sucked. Alright. So I'm on the next floor. I'm on 4F. Yeah, so this floor is an asshole. So it's just a grid. You uh -huh. you basically just want to go all the way down to the southeast corner from where you are. No treasure, though. There's fucking literally nothing on this floor. <laughs> Vampire Lord. Wow, he hits hard. And dies quick. There it is. Alright. Alright, and then once you get to the... 5F? That's gonna be... I think that one's a... that's a big deal, so... Yep, um... You walk down the long, narrow bridge. This, this... path is home of the War Mech, renamed yep. the Death Machine. Do you know why... Um, do you want to know why this is significant? Uh... sure, I guess. Have you heard of Chris Houlihan? Okay, I'm not gonna warn you the War Mech. Name is familiar. It's the secret room in the Legend of Zelda: Link to the Past. That I am Chris Houlihan. This is my yeah. secret room. So the yeah. rumor is is that he won a contest for Final Fantasy back in the day. That's how he got his name in there. <coughs> and that contest was you had to take a picture of the War Mech and send it in because it has a low encounter rate of one in one, uh, one in sixty four, walking mm -hmm. down that path. And it doesn't tell you where it is. No one knew where it was in nineteen ninety. So. Huh. Interesting. I did not know that's how he won them. If he exists. That's just the... It's, well, the, it's sure. the story. It's essentially a creepypasta. Except it's not creepy. Although, I, so this wretched... The walkthrough I was reading... It says that that is true. The chances of fighting it on the bridge are 1 default. But it says in the NES version of this game, there were no random battles, so you were guaranteed to fight at least one war mech on the bridge. Oh, one on the bridge in 64 battles. Okay. That's a weird way of phrasing that, but alright. Dawn of Souls has a true random battle system, so if you want to find the war mech, you have to prepare for a very long, very boring search, assuming that you want to fight him. I see. So Not actually, really. it was more likely to fight it in the NES version, is what I'm gathering from that. Sure, I'm not going to waste my time. We're not wasting our time on that shit. Yeah, that's fine. To get the reward of death. Great. Looking forward to it. And apparently... I'm trying to see if they were even... He has a 1 in 20 chance of giving you the Genji armor. Don't care. I can't equip it anyway, probably. Uh, probably not. All right, here we go, Tiamat. Any strategies I need to know? Ooh. Uh, let's see. Tiamat likes to use attacks to target the entire party. Fortunately, they are not nearly as strong as the Warmex nuke. Cast haste fine. on your main damage dealer and your healer as necessary. Uh, the fight can benefit greatly from the null line of spells. So if you have them, consider using them. Saber. And 
Corsera. Magic. Haste. Magic. He has very high magic resistance. Yes. Yeah, he's got 200 magic defense versus his 80 normal defense. So you may want to just try to focus on buffing the shit out of your monk and then like using the black mage for like either buffing or healing spells. We'll say though. Twenty-four really... hits! Twenty-four fucking hits! Yeah. <laughs> nice. But didn't do a lot of damage. Okay. Um what now? Have him at sack. Actually. Let's, uh, let's get some giant giant's gloves. Anyway, what I was saying though is like the the boss sprites in this game are like fucking awesome. Yes, they are. So let's see. Oh, we're actually. Oh god. Okay. Well, sort of. I'll say we're actually pretty close to the end of the game. Now. Yeah, we are. I know we needed to do another one or two. I didn't know how many, but we weren't going to make it. We wanted to finish it before the end of the year. Yeah. So apparently the adamantite can be converted into Scalibur sword. Can any of our people actually use that? I don't think so. ultimate weapon well in the original game <laughs> apparently in dawn of souls they added two other weapons that are actually better than that one. uh the muramasa and the masamune no according to this is the ragnarok and the ultima weapon makes sense uh that was an easy battle actually oh here we go Excalibur. Equip the... Uh, yeah, okay, so literally only the knight can equip it. Great. That's what we need. So that's a waste. Yeah. Um, okay, so I guess the other things that we can do if we want to, and I don't know if we do, no. before we go to the final show showdown, is there's also the optional Soul of Chaos dungeons. No. Okay, well, in that case, I think we can you know, skip this entire section and walk through them. That's the extra content. Okay. Uh, so we don't care about that. Oh, so that's what those little cutscenes of the statues disappearing are. That's the entrances to the optional dungeon. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Okay, so don't care, don't care, don't care. Yeah, so actually we're headed to the Temple of Fiends then. We're at like the last thing. I will set you up. I got you, my man. We're gonna buy some spells. Some nice spells. Spellsy spells. Mmm.
Yeah, I guess uh, this is <clears throat> basically the point of no return after we. So whatever we need to get, we should get it. Yes. I'm getting your Deathbringer back. Just like the name of that. All right. So first, let's go to Gaia. If we called it what we called it when we were kids, we would be banned from Twitch, probably. <laughs> Especially after their latest little fireside chat thing that they oh had. God. Is that the one where they said that you can't accuse people of sleeping with people on Twitch for popularity? Uh, probably. It's also the same one where they said that you can't call people simps. That's ridiculous. Yeah. They're like, uh, it's a derogatory sexual term. And I'm like, what? Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, towards simps. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Which is kind of the fucking point. Um, uh, we're banned. No, I'm. Uh, I don't know what spells. They don't. They, don't, they don't care about us. We're not. We're not ninja. They don't care. Where's the other level 7 spells? There's only two here. Uh, let's see. Oh, spell level 7. Are you looking for white spells or black spells? Black. What have you already gotten? You got what? Break. I got null death. I got null death for the the red wizard, and Blizzaga and break. I'm assuming. Okay, so Blizzaga is ice three. Yes. Um. Did you get saber? No, I but I guess I'm we don't gonna... need it, right? No. I wouldn't use it because they're they're going to be doing other things. Well, then that's it. For level 7 for black spells, you have Blind, Break, Blazaga, and Saber. How about for white spells? So, white spells, you have um, Cure 4, whatever that translates to. The Red Wizard can't get Cure 4, right? Or can he? Uh, he cannot. Okay. What else? He also cannot get... Whatever the damage one is. Uh, DR. Um, DR, goth, whatever. Yeah, they Dia just call goth. it harm for. <laughs> yeah. Um. Dia the only one that he can use is the Null Death. Great! For level 7 spells, that's it. Only Null Death, which is pretty useless because everyone can only equip protect rings which nullify death yep what are the and what are the other black spells I'm sorry uh was what was it blind break uh, uh, I, uh blitzaga and saber so blind and I'm not gonna use it Okay. Yeah. It's like D and D. It's like that's a fucking useless spell. You gotta fill out your spell slots, dude. No, I don't. It's a dumb spell. It's the only one you can use, you bard. Look. I know bards get a lot of shitty spells. It's what you do with them. I don't know, man. Bards like get some bards. pretty good ones. Now they do. Get that sweet dissonant whispers action. Cutting words. Those are good. Uh, what was it? Poly. Polymorph. Yeah. Polymorph's really good. Alright! We got that. Oh, there's probably. Not. No, there's no item shop here because they suck. Yeah, no. Forgot to go to the item shop. I can, yeah, I'll go back to Gaia and go to the item shop there for high potions instead of stuff. I know 
Oh, I'm using my items. It's not like it matters. I have to head back to Corneria anyway, really. That's a 30 guild visit. Burninate! Countryside. Buy the items. And we'll have to get just pure potions at uh, the straight, not pure, straight pure potions at uh, Corneria. I only use three high potions. Wow. Use more ethers. Should I get 99 Phoenix Downs? <laughs> I mean, I feel like if we need that many, we might have bigger... It's not like we can do fucking anything else with the money. This is probably one of the cheapest... Other than the mage, like, the, the magic buying aspect, this is one of the cheapest parties you can have. It's not there. What do we leave down there? Anything? Mm -hmm. Get some potions. The Chaos Shrine. They're so mysterious! Hopefully it takes less than two hours to beat the Chaos Shrine, because we're going to beat it on Sunday. It's my turn to play anyway, unless you want to play on Sunday. It's up to you. No, that's fine. Okay. I think you're going to gonna do it. If my computer decides to work. I'll send you the, I'll send you the save files just in case. Yeah, that <laughs> might not be a bad idea. <laughs> To the Chaos Shrine. We are almost done with this game. I think we've only had one total party death. That was the time that you were about to die and you had to reload the save state. So I think we've 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 done we've done well for ourselves on this on this run. With this party. Like Again, I know it's for charity, but I told you before, I didn't reload a save state for that. Yes, you did! No, I didn't. We were about to have a total party death. It was going to happen. It was about to happen. Alright, well, you and I might be thinking of two different instances then, but... Fine. We'll, 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 we'll go with it. It's fine. It's for the children. It is for the children. Okay, we're at 14 hours and one minute, so... Next week! I think this is it. I think this is, this is, this is it. Not even next week. This week on Sunday. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Exit. Okay, that's definitely safe. Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. After you're done getting fat with your Christmas family, unless your family lives in a different location, you can't travel to see them, I'm sorry. After that, come join us Sunday, 9 o'clock, Eastern Time, to watch the Final Fantasy 1 Fall Challenge finale. 
where I will be taking on Chaos with Shane guiding me. It might have to that be an extra right. long. We're we're gonna beat it, okay? We're gonna beat it. That that's just gonna ha- how it's gonna be. We're just gonna beat. We are going to beat this game, and we are not gonna stop until this game is done. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. It's like I mean, I might be underestimating it, but it's just it's just one dungeon, right? I can't I can't take two hours. That one dungeon did just take two hours. <laughs> Fine. So let's. Yeah. We'll, if if we need, we'll just get okay. But we'll, we'll focus more on what the important treasures are, what we can use, because we don't need gill anymore. If a treasure chest has fucking gill in it, get fuck treasure chest. So, yeah, we're beating the game next. Yeah, week. there there are apparently nine levels of chaos shrines. So that's <sighs> we might need to make a beeline unless it has a weapon that we can use, weapon armor we can use. Yeah, so I'll I'll make a strategy. I'll come up with a plan, and we're gonna we're gonna do it this Sunday. We're going to beat Final Fantasy 1. And again, if you're watching this on YouTube, because I most of you probably are, if you are seeing this, check out the link that's right to the right of my head and go and, and do it for Child's Play, do it for the children. Uh, if you have some shekels to toss around this holiday season, throw it that way. And you have even more shekels, you can check out our merch store, which is bit.ly slash rhp merch, and get a fantastic coffee mug or stein or t-shirt or something, man. They are high quality. I'm wearing one right now, guys. It's so I love these shirts. I love these shirts. I, my friends love these shirts, and uh, sure. even my dad bought one. And I don't think he listens to my fucking podcast, but he bought one, and uh, <laughs> he likes it too. Apparently, so there you go. There you go. And if you have even more shekels to spare, in fact, before you go to the merch store, because I'd recommend going here before the merch store because it is cheaper, uh, by and large. Go to our Patreon which is bit.ly slash rh patron. And you can go there and you can get some exclusive audio content at all levels uh, from RHP Gaiden, which is, or RH Gaiden. I don't know what we're technically calling this. RH Gaiden or RHP Gaiden, Shane? What would you, what do you like more? It's the RH Gaiden. RH Gaiden. That's available to all patrons. And right now I'm working on a game to try and uh, get another episode. And I think I have a couple things lined up. Um for future episodes so that's going to be pretty I'm, I'm working on making that robust uh in the future um it's up to shame whether or not he wants to this is kind of my side project that i'm doing uh that i'm editing and learning how to edit so you get to hear what i do when i edit it's going to be a high bar because shane does some fantastic wonderful quality editing that i need to live up to so i'm, I'm doing that on that side project <laughs> and hopefully we can get you that on that on that secondary thing for all levels but if you even on higher levels they get even more exclusive content so go check that out and we always have our discord which is available to everybody it is open to the public and that is at bit.ly slash rhp chat or if you can't find that if that's too inconvenient just hit us up on instagram at uh retro hangover and the breakdown though below below yeah you can find us all there and you can if the, you don't want to talk to them you just if we, them i we are them if you want to talk to us <laughs> If you just want to talk to me for some reason, I don't know, because you're still probably going to be talking to me. I'm at at Zodiac on Instagram, uh, X-O-D-Y-A-K, and you can find me there. Uh, I think that covers most of it. There's anything I missed? Uh, you know what? I, th- I think you did a stellar job. I think you've covered everything. I think I think I did it. Okay, sweet. Cool. In the meantime, guys, until next That's right. time, play with your anticipated wet and moist chaos shrine encrusted joysticks have a great night very gross (laughs)